small, then I'll throw some TNT at you. Just let it graze you, then we'll call it a finish, all right? Okay, something about TNT. Awesome! And you, what name do you go by? Uh, I'm gonna need a name. Come on, Jesse. They call me the Amulet Holder. You heard the name, folks. Give a big death ball welcome to the... Amulet Holder! Then let's begin! Opponents will craft their own griefing towers, which they will then use to grief each other. The only rule is... There are no rules! <laughs> no eye poking! Other than that, go crazy! Seriously. Oh. Amulet Holder! Pick your building material, and Magnus, you... Man, I'm good. Brought my own supply. Let the griefing begin! Wood, some stone, some... Ooh, pink wool? Stone it is. Mm, not bad. Not bad. Guess it'll have to do. Axel, what are you doing over there on his side? Yeah, thought you might bring that up. It's just that Reuben wanted to take your corner, and I didn't want to crowd him or anything, so I thought I'd um watch from over here. Take your best shot! How you shouldn't grow an egg. Ha! You grief with me, you grief with the best! So, amulet holder, taking an amulet isn't enough. You need to take my crown as well. I do not discriminate in my accessory taking. Your crown shall be mine. You are but a student! Prepare yourself, for I am here to give you your final lesson. Ah! Uh, um, that was just a warning! What? A warning that you need glasses? It seems the student has become the master, and the amulet holder will win the day. I don't know what that means, but I love it and want to put it on a t-shirt! <laughs> but what happened to getting hit by my TNT? Nobody messes with the Boom Master! Uh-oh. Jesse! Jesse, you okay? Had enough yet? Alrighty! I think noob time is over. Part of throwing the fight was that! What say you, noob? I am king! And those who challenge me will be annihilated! Jesse, I think he just lost it. Magnus, crack the cannon! Yeah! Finish him with a cannon! 
If it's a cannon you want, it's a cannon you'll get! Yep, he's completely lost it. Dude's going for the kill. Jesse, you'd better craft the, I don't know, greatest thing of your life, like right now. Well, there's still some material in the chest. That's it, Jesse, go! He yeah, actually check it out. <laughs> that should hold him. Yeah, it's, yeah, um, yeah, it might do, but Jesse, look. <laughs> We're supposed to throw the fight. <laughs> Jesse, look out! or something. Whoa, in a cannon fight? Actually, there are all sorts of cliched lines about this. Yeah, but the TNT inside the cannon. TNT plus arrow. Oh, yeah. Time to see how well you fly, pig. Ruben! Boom! I got you, I got you. Man. Delicious right now. Hey, Magnus! Yeah? Short stuff? Flying pig jokes are totally played out. Sometimes, I don't know, gives a speech. People of Boomtown, bow before your new ruler. You may grumble, you may groan, but I'm in charge now. Well, you guys ready then? Oh, yeah! This will be a way easier target than Magnus. Wait, what's going on? Oh, well, that's not good. Holy crap! Is that your wither storm? How are we? What are we? That's... Ah! Oh no! Oh no! No! No 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 no! Stop eating my kingdom! Magnus, come on! You'll regret messing with Boomtown! Go! Just a little farther. Well, 
Someone really went bonkers with the defenses, huh? <laughs> Jesse? Is that you? Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? Nice! I'm so glad you're back. And we brought Magnus! Fantastic! Quick, come on. You guys are never gonna believe who showed up while you were gone. Petra! Hey guys, how's it going? Petra, you made it! It's good to see you too, big guy. And it's really good to see you, Jesse. Back there in Gabriel's bunker, it got pretty dicey. I don't understand. How did you escape? You pulled me out of that Witherstorm's crutches, and I ran and ran and ran for the temple. If you hadn't saved me, well, I owe you everything, Jesse. I'm just glad I heard Gabriel telling you where to go. Wow, did Gabriel get away too? Did you see? It's all a blur, but the weather storm left almost nothing behind. Everything, everyone, was just gone. It even got Gabriel. Wow, been a while since I've been here. Whoa. What is she doing here? Call this a hunch, but do you two not like each other? Right, um, I forgot to mention, Olivia went on a little expedition of her own while you were gone. And this Olivia person came back with her? Did you know about this? Did Eligard put you up to this? You think you know a guy, and then, bam. Olivia's a friend of mine. I didn't know that she was going off to recruit Eligard. Magnus, you gotta believe me. Well, I certainly don't have anything to say to her. Jesse, Jesse, look, I found Eligard. Just hang on a sec, okay? I'll go figure out what's going on. Good, you do that. Easy now, Olivia. Let's try and play it cool, hmm? So, who are you now? And why did you bring him with you? We are reuniting the Order of the Stone. It was kind of crazy, actually. I went to Redstonia, and there were all these incredible engineers and inventors. It was a little intimidating, actually, but Eligard's made me her protege. Well, assistant for now. I mean, after what happened. I know, I'm sorry. So sorry. Well, I'm the king of Boomtown. Very impressive. She might have, well, embarrassed herself. A tiny bit. Yeah, but after I pled my case, she agreed to take me on as her assistant and come back to help. Not bad, right? Oh, hooray! It's Ellie, and here I was just starting to enjoy myself. Hello, Magnus. Your voice is exactly as pleasant as I remember, which is to say, not at all. Oh, my feelings. Is that the same wit you're gonna use to save the world? Why? You're here to tell me how to do it better? Oh, I would never dream of doing that. Unlike you, I actually do things instead of just talking about them. Hey, that's Eligard you're talking to. Show her some respect. Wow, you finally found yourself a live one. Hey! Would you all cut it out? Holy crap, you're all acting like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. Yeah, I'll admit, that thing looked real nasty. And I've seen some nasty stuff in my time. Too much for you, was it? Your usual brutish approach didn't cut it? Hey, you weren't there, all right? You didn't see how this thing just tore everything up. This arguing isn't helping anything. We want to stop that thing? We're going to need some serious firepower. Jesse's right. We need to find some way to stop that thing. 
I don't know if you've looked around yet, but this place isn't nearly the stronghold it used to be. Most of our supplies are gone. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Are they getting along? Can we start crafting some then? I don't think we got that kind of time. But even if we had all the TNT for miles around, I don't know if it would be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie, not this again. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. There's something stronger than TNT? Soren had a super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formidabomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F-bomb before. F-bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F-bomb could destroy anything. Well, the Formidabomb sounds perfect. We should go get it now. Well, there's a little problem there. We don't know where Soren is. But you found us. Do you know where he is? Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the Nether. Or the End. But it's worth a shot. We can find him. Hey, Olivia, you okay? I'm all right. I can't shake the feeling that I embarrassed myself back in Redstonia, in front of Eligard. I think she kind of judges me a little bit. It'll be okay. I hope you're right. All right, there's your light, my light. That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order, broke up. That's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, he invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little... Weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that, at any rate. So, why aren't we going? Is there some kind of problem? Whoa. It didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Who is that? Oh, no, it's... That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move! It's not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Perfect. We can wait till tomorrow morning and travel with a full day's sunlight. Uh, and risk that thing catching up with us? I think I've had enough wither storm for one day. Ah, uh, thank you very much. Right, because getting caught out there in the dark is so much better. Trust me. If you had seen this thing, you wouldn't want to stick around. Yeah, I don't want the Witherstorm catching up with us. We should go now. Jesse here is talking a lot of sense. Let's just go with that plan. You're just saying that because it's your plan, but... Fine. 